Janie Lane from Warren. And I'm Ricky Rackman. You are not ready for primetime VJ. And it's time for the year end metal countdown. Janie, what is the year end metal countdown? For the next two hours, it's the best hard rock metal videos in 1990. Very Dude. professional dude and on the way in the next 30 minutes we've got rat we've got cinderella but right now we've got a video from a bunch of guys that you are uh, currently on the road with right yeah we had a great show last can you night. tell us any real quick uh, five second bad stories i can dirty story <laughs> <laughs> no i'm skinny bob MTV Unplugged. This week on MTV Unplugged. Poison. Your mama know a dance. Daddy don't rock and roll. Every road has a stone. Tonight at 11, 10 Central. It doesn't always have to be electric. The year in metal countdown. I'm Janie Lane from Warren. I'm Ricky Rackman from, from uh, Mars. Here. I don't know where I'm from. We're trying to find out. Hey, Bob, just before this, we played the number 17 video, which was Faster Pussycat with House of Pain. I'm supposed to clear this story up for you. We know those guys. We know those guys, we know those sort guys. of. But anyway, uh, you might have seen Sally Jesse Raphael. Uh, show recently and they had some uh, I guess you would call it for lack of a better word groupies on the show and they were asking the groupies I don't know if you heard this story maybe no, you can relate met, to something I met like those groupies <laughs> they had the groupies on the got. show and um and Sally <laughs> she likes it when I, I just call her Sally I didn't okay well Sally asked one of the girls is there any rock star that both of you have slept with and uh, the, ro the groupies, both of them kind of laughed and said, well, we both slept with Tammy down, a faster pussycat. And Tammy wanted me to tell all of you out there that he did not sleep with either of those girls. So it's probably the only two girls that he has. He but he, he <laughs> didn't know with those, those two girls. Tammy, why don't you tell us about the next video that we've got for these fun rat, people out Rat, there. We got we got Rat coming up. Loving you is a dirty job. That's what... Steven's Someone's last ten girlfriends. Someone's probably gotta do it. Tammy <laughs> probably did it. Here's Rat. <laughs> We're back again, the year in metal countdown. I'm Janie Lane from Warren. I'm Ricky Rackman, actually. I just I'm Sybil. I'm working on it. <laughs> You're Linda Blair. That's it. Watch my head spin around. What have we got coming up, Janie? Please. Uh, well, we have Aerosmith the other side, which uh, I dig Aerosmith. We actually we did some shows with them oh, I didn't even this know past that. summer with uh, Aerosmith and Metallica and Warren and the Black Where was Crows. That? that was wild. That's stadiums cool in stadiums in Canada and. Uh, and Rochester, New York, and wow. that was that was killer. And Ballad of Jane by oh, Ellie Guns, which was like my favorite ballad that came out this summer. So. Oh, really? Yeah. I because Jane so. sounds like Janie. Yeah. Janie. Those are all it's part no, of this, it's this, no this great style design, though. No, it's that little twist. Anyways, uh, right now it's time to play number 14, a band that's got a new record out. And whenever you see the drummer, he really likes it when you call him Cupcake. So everybody <laughs> do it, okay? This I is Cinderella. Frank. This is a great he's breaking stuff on the desk. Yes, I'm sorry. This is uh, off the new record. This song is great. The album is great. Real, real bluesy. Have you heard? You've heard I haven't heard it, but I everybody. You've heard this song, right? Great. No, I haven't, heard the, I haven't had a chance. Well, I'm living on the road right now. now. Well, I never get a let's chance. Let's sit back and listen to it. I like this song a lot. I think you will, too. I think Janie will, too. It's I think Tom Keeper is one of the best songwriters in the world. Well, that's funny, because he happens to sing and songwrite in yeah. the song. <laughs> Cinderella with Shelter Me. He plays a little guitar in there. Just Remember, it's up to you! Hi, I'm Ricky Rackman. Once again, you're not ready for primetime. BJ lost some. We're stuck here right now in primetime. And I'm and Janie Lane from, from Point Warrant. Yeah. I'm getting so band. confused now. And this is the year end metal countdown now. Uh, we're kind of looking back at year 1990, and it looks like in year 1990 you got a little more ink. Yeah, I did. I got a. Uh, actually, I still got about four more colors. Are those colors. real? Do they hurt? It itches right now. Yeah. Too. But I wanted to 
just like you. I dig your type. What, what, what kind of the kind of kind of the tattoo guys you can tell? Yeah, so you can, the male bonding thing. It's that male tattoo thing here on No, MTV. we have a we have a tattoo artist out on tour with us. We took him out for like the last three weeks. Uh -huh. His name's John Rainey. He's really good. So maybe he'll do the rest of my arm for free. Oh, and that's it. I get mine done. It's <laughs> no, I'm getting tattoo. sleeved. I want to get sleeved now. So. Uh -huh. You know, so we're gonna have a tattoo kind of so you can get them sleeved. Yeah. Dude. So we're, when we come out with the metal dictionary, it means that uh, sleeved is covering your entire arm with tattoos. And if you look in the metal dictionary under number eleven, what would you it find says there, Jamie? Tattoo Nikki Six. No. no. Number eleven. Oh. Yes. The See, scorpion. this was a perfect segue, and you just I'm blew sorry. it, man. Uh, we were going there. <laughs> and no. We no. lost that moment. The scorpion. You know what? I went out with Klaus on his birthday in Los Angeles. You went out. Those with guys him? are so cool. Real, they are. They were here on the headbang on the headbangers ball. <laughs> I dig them. Scorpions, tease me. Please me. Number 11. It must be that wacky old year-end metal countdown. I'm Ricky Rackman, and this is Janie Lane. Thanks for saying that for me. Just to remind you. ACDC's on the way as we count down the top hard rock metal videos of 1990. Speaking of 1990, as it is coming to the close, as it is the holiday season. It was a great year. Huh? It was, a, a, it was a great year. year. Yeah, you guys like started kicking it right back on the road again. We, did, we took no time off. No time uh, off. Just right in, did the record right back out on the road. Now, cool. as we lead into 1991, do you have any New Year's resolutions? That you're probably going to break anyway. But do you have I any got so resolutions? many. I got so many New Year's resolutions. I have to stop biting my fingernails. Mm -hmm. That's one thing I definitely got to do. Stop that so bad yeah. habit. And I just did hey, it right through the gloves. You know you've the gloves, pal. Biting my fingernails. No, I. You know what my biggest New Year's resolution is? Is I want a headline this year. So hopefully we're gonna we'll finish up the Poison tour, and then we may go to Europe with David Lee Roth. We may not, but we're definitely gonna when uh when May comes around and it starts going to the outdoor venues, that's when we want to headline. Mm. So, I don't know who we'll take out with us, but... but meanwhile, you guys are out on the road currently with Poison. And yeah. I just saw the show and it was a Everything's great show. Great. Yeah, so it's, it's a fun show, too. Well, right now, let's play the uh, number seven video. Here is Slaughter with Fly to the Angels. We're Millie Vanilli. <laughs> I'm Gino Vanilli. I had to say that. The other one. I'm Jamie. Oh, but Lane you didn't really Warren. say it. I didn't say it. Because well, we're Millie Vanilli. Somebody else said it for us. But it, yeah. Well, anyways. Um, I'm laugh. Janie from Warren. I'm Ricky yeah. Rackman from the 7-Eleven down the street. And this is the year-end metal countdown. And right now, we're up to the top ten. And our buds. Our buds. Our buds. Our buds. Our buds. Our buds. Our top ten. And Motley. Um, Crew. Who you were also on the road with. We Who haven't you been on the road with? We're playing all, we all these guys. Everybody. <laughs> you name them, we toured with them. But we, uh, we toured for a while with Molly. They were, they were one of the coolest bands we ever Put on with. the greatest live show That's I've good. ever seen. Yeah, that was a killer tour. Actually, half their crew is working for us now, so it's still kind of almost mm -hmm. like the same. So you kept them employed. He was stealing people left and right. That's no, a good thing. That was a great tour. I had a blast. Well, here they are with Motley Crew. Here they are, Motley Crew. We don't go away, man. <laughs> That was number nine with Winger. Winger. And here's a band that I was out on the road with. No, tell us about this. Who can describe the number eight video better than yourself? I don't want to describe the number eight, but you describe the number eight video. Oh, this is the this is my favorite video that we've ever done. Uh, it was the funnest video to do. Really, we've ever done. Explain. Absolutely. Explain for me, Janie. Explain what? It was, Why it was so <laughs> no. fun. What made this? It video was so fun. fun. It was great. It was like a three day shoot. And we didn't do it. You know, we it's fun because you got the big bucks for it. Tell us the truth. That was it. Yeah. The I big mean, bucks came rolling. And it was fun. Video. It was very fun because of the co-star, too. I and mean, I, mean, I don't think you were talking was... about the guys in the band. No. Was... No, I'm not. We were, we'll no, leave it up. She was great to work with. We'll leave it up to everybody's imagination on how much fun they actually had filming this video. Cherry pie! Like we're winding out. down. We're winding down. You're in metal count. We're winding down. Yes, winding down. We're up to the but, top three. And it's them guys again. Those those, those crazy guys, guys that I see every night. Hi Bobby. Hi Cece. Hi Ricky. Hi Brett. Who could it be that you're talking about? <laughs> 
Oh, it's poison. <laughs> In case they didn't figure out. And they are number three. Give me something to believe in. Yeah, yeah. It's coming towards 91 soon, and this is the year-end metal countdown. I'm Ricky Rackman. You sound so quiet. I did. I was yeah. kind of mellow. And this is Janie from Warren. Not mellow. And we're here. We are here. Number we're wrapping one. up that year-end metal countdown. Number and now it's time one. for number one. Can we get a drum roll, please? That was good. I like that. <laughs> this... I'm happy. So I'm glad that these I'm guys happy. are number one. They, come, they, they said that they are the raw this goes out, of rock and roll. This goes out to T-Bone, which in case you didn't know, that's Tommy Lee. Nice! Dude. And <laughs> Nikki is going to be dad out? in like yeah. a month, too. Oh, yeah, that's gonna have, There's going to be Gunner 6 out here pretty soon. And here's our present. So in case it was actually, guess. it was up to just Janie and myself. We decided to make this number one. It was up to us. It had exactly. nothing to do with MDB. So you guys and Motley, remember, it was just up to me and Janie, and we decided to make you guys number one. So give us cars, okay? Here's Molly <laughs> Crew. Same old situation. situation. This portion of Monsters of Rock Sunday. What are you crazy? <laughs> that was number one Motley Crew on the, that old countdown. Funny. Uh, same old situation, hey, son. Same old crazy situation. Crazy numbskulls. What a... Now, now, here's the Kugel. Let's get a nice cape lock on a nice guy and say, I just get that sheet caught in the cuss from my tooth. No. He was saying that was the number one video yeah. for the year in Metal Countdown. Yeah. And, um, this was fun. Yeah. I'm glad you could hang. I'll see you, know, you, have, in, you, have, you have you been acquainted with Jennifer I'll yet? I'll see you in Phoenix, dude. Well, so we'll be in Phoenix. When we're jamming. You That's should true. mention that now and let people I know. They're flying from all over I the country. I can't do that kind of stuff. Can I do it? Go, no, I don't know. Let's talk about 91. Come Why on, make can I do it? Can I do it? We're going to be at... Well, all right, I won't say it. Cat House, Arizona with Warren. Yeah, anyway, exactly. Um, why don't you talk After a little the poison bit? Poison show. <laughs> why don't you talk? This is Rock it. No. Talk about other predictions for '91. I mean, the '90s been good for you. '89. I've seen you guys since you were in the little clubs, and I recently saw you guys play the Meadowlands, and it was it was kind of weird because it really hadn't hit the huge. Because I've seen you guys in the little clubs, you know, when well, you guys were playing you. in L.A. <laughs> <laughs> but um, I mean, people were screaming. They were going nuts. Yeah, it's really cool. It's great, man. It's just it's just gone. I mean, it's gotten better and better and better. It we did like uh, 282 shows on the first tour, 16 months straight. Finally landed a really cool tour with Motley Crue, mm -hmm. which was great. And as soon as we ended it, right back in the studio, did the record right back out on tour. And, and you're a little nervous when when you're coming out with your second record because you don't know if people are going to remember you or if they're going to wait for you to fall on your face or whatever. And as soon as we did the first show. On the Poison Tour, the crowd was just... Oh, the crowds were really good. And it's happening, so... Hey, you said something... I just want you to just say this, because you say something that at some of the shows that I've seen you play in the bigger venues about parting with the fans. There's like yeah. a little sense you say that I think is really cool, and that's... Well, I'll leave the cussing out. Uh, okay. You know, but just say, say no, I say, we mean condition. it, too. We, we, we party every night with the crowd. We say, if you can't party with the people that came out to see you, then you shouldn't play for them in the first place, and I believe that. That's definitely. very cool. Absolutely. We'll leave you with that. Everybody, during the holiday season, please do not get drunk and drive. It's much, if you get really drunk, try to walk home. It's really funny to see where you or end get up a anyway, tour but bus. don't drive. Get a tour bus. Anyways, um, I'm Ricky Rackman. I'm Janie Lane. And thanks a lot for hanging with us in the Metal Camp, and I had a lot of fun. We'll see you. See ya.